let's get you to that. How about here today? Two stops for bow. Okay. Thank 
actually on the E string. Just a little string. One. Good. And let's go, I'm sorry, I didn't tap this before, but let's play two coming down here. Just as we did in A major. Oh, okay. Two, and then we'll play two here. Okay? Oh, okay. So let's go from the top. And we from the thing. That away. Frog, frog.
let's do, uh, let's see, I forgot how to turn my message on. Wow. Okay, got it. Okay, let's do long. And we 
play P, G, D, C. So two, one, two, two, here. Cool. And then let's take this first two arpeggios and with the three for both. Okay. Okay? So a new scale. Awesome. Okay. I mean, by this time they're all the same. <laughs> you just start on a different note. Okay, let's see. How about your pink book here? Okay. Like we're coming to the end of this, aren't we? Mm -hmm. So this is pretty mm -hmm. complicated. Um, okay, so this mm -hmm. I was assigned to do over the, the time period uh -huh. uh, uh, between the end of mm -hmm. And then you also um, s told me to start this and this. Right. Uh -huh. And then I also just started this, okay. and Zoe put a date on it uh -huh. um, on Thursday. Okay. So now, what we have to do, we have to get book two. Do you have book two yes. already? Yes. Okay. So um, the we're going to start that right away, and because we'll just work on these at the same time now. Okay. So we want to do. It's called Blumenstengel. Okay. Okay. So it's re the first real H is in the book. So you can do that for next time. Okay. And then how about let me hear how you did. Did you do all the double stops here? Yes. Okay, so let's do from here. Let's do yes. first separate. I will use the whole bow.
next one. Okay. Let's do the code again. You got it, but...
that with this blue.
work these out with um, Michael a little bit more. Okay. And, and the octaves are really important. I want to just do these. And see, I'm going to shift slowly down. I glide on top of the string. Can you just do that? That's it. So that's how light.
Okay, let's pat you on this one. Okay. And then what I do, I don't go in this order. I know oh, Zoe okay. gave that to you. Uh, but um, the next one I do is uh, this one here. So we'll get a paper clip here. So okay. Uh, and what we'll do, we're going to do play it with... And then uh, in the next few days you can do the other half. Okay. But always find your code. So here, this is the fifth, right? So then. We might uh, build up the this with a little cork. I have some. Oh, you probably have some. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Just a little bit so that that uh, you don't have to raise your shoulder. Okay, let's do that again. That's right. But you want to just feel that you have your you're balancing your instrument between your magic X and your thumb. That's mm -hmm. right. Can you just go up and down like this? Good. Can you bend your knees? That's right. Good. And can you just slide up and down? That's right. So just slide on your magic X and let your thumb support help support it. That's right. So if you want your violin to go up, you just raise here, not the shoulder though. Can, can raise the violin way off the shoulder. This is a, well, keep it. That's right. Keep the bottom on your body. Good. Okay. And now just lower it. That's right. So you don't want to feel that when you raise your violin that you're raising your shoulder. Uh -huh. yeah, you just, you just have to stay. Watch your feet though. Uh -huh. They have to stay well balanced. Good. Good. So if we say raise your violin, how do you do that? That's it. That's it. That's it. So okay. Michael's going to keep an eye on that. Okay. 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 Because I think does the chin rest feel pretty comfortable? Yes. Okay. Okay, I think we need to just put a little cork underneath. Okay, here we go. So we start at the frog.
going to go from here. D. Stop it. Keep your bow moving. D is good. And your violin's a little goofy. Good. Never, no shoulder up. Good. Better. Good. Good. Okay, good. And the rest is good. So pass your and just Okay. Out. How about this one? So this is what I hear. I oh, hear. Yeah. So we want to shift on the up bow, on the old bow. Good. Here. Good. So you, you need to come under a little bit more. So see if I'm here. I can't read, mm -hmm. so I have to.
But I want to get you set up on some vibrato uh, sequence exercise okay. that um, we're going to do it in fourth position. Okay. And you can always go to the website to look at how to do this. And this mm -hmm. is called uh, finger wiggling. Ooh, cool. Oh, cool. Okay, so we'll s go to fourth position. We'll first thing start with our second finger. So two, three, four. We find our code. Mm -hmm. Then we know that with the vibrato, we're going to release the wrist, the arm, and the finger. Mm -hmm. So we maybe did some of these before, but these we're going to do for a, a bunch of time now. So these are called the wiggles. So we're going to do first the wrist. Wiggle. See how my wrist? Wiggle, wiggle. Two for both. Oh, yes. And then three. And four. And five. And six. See how loose the other side? So that's the first way we'll do it. So find your code first. So we play E, good, and first two. No, you're right, F sharp. F, G, A. So we find the code so that the balance of the hand is going to be comfy. So that and the thumb. Okay, so we just leave the heel here and we do wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle, good. Now we're always going to start, stop at the back. Okay. Good, but that's good. Good, feel the wrist though. Good. Good, now we'll go with three. Good, now when we do the wrist, we keep the heel against the side. So we really feel that we're using the wrist. So one, two, no, but it's still against the side. One, two, but so let's do three now. One, two, three, good. One, two, three, good. You don't need to go so far back, just. Good. And can you do four? Two, and then rest, and we go all the way to the top. Really loose, really loose finger. And five, three, four, five, and six, four, five, six. Good. Good. Okay, that's it. See how that knuckle? We're freeing that knuckle there. Mm -hmm. Then we're going to go with the arm. So wiggle. See, so I move. My finger gets to flatten out, mm -hmm. not the wrist out, but my uh, my forearm moves my finger back, and I always have to hit the side here. So go, but we, we keep so, no, but then hit that up. So ba -da, and then you touch the side, and then twice. One, two. One, two, but that, that you, like, it's like you're sliding on your magic X. You see, like you're really sliding here. Mm -hmm. And three, two, good, good. So listen again. Yeah, can you just do this? Can you just slide on your magic X? That's right, that's right. Two, Wiggle. Okay, now we'll do two. We hit this set twice. And again, one, two, and, and then three. Two, three, and then four. Four. One, two, three, four, five. Four, five. Two, ooh, but you didn't know you have to hit the five. Three, four, five. Four, five. That's it. So just go to five for that. Okay. Okay. Then the next thing, just with the finger. 
we just go slowly, just slowly. Just go to stringpedagogy.com. Okay. And look for uh, wiggling finger wiggles. Okay. Okay? Cool. Okay. And, and that would be really helpful that Michael helps you with that. Okay. Now, let's, you're doing tempo diminuendo and Sicilian and, and the Beethoven. Yes. Okay. So let's start with your tempo diminuendo and then you have your Sicilian. Okay. Ooh, lots of good stuff here. <laughs> okay. And I've memorized this. Mm -hmm. would I've never played mm -hmm. this for uh, oh, that's the, the back side. Right? Yes, the I've piano. Uh, yes, okay. and I've never played it for you. For the yeah. Music. So we'll I use the music in oh, case okay. we need to write anything in, and then your pianist is going to be um, uh, Justin. Oh yay! Cool. Yeah, yeah, he's our official pianist this year. Awesome, he's Justin Guru. So. Uh -huh. Okay, here we go. So let's hear your A. Yeah, you know, you this 
is such a great piece. It's a, such a great opener for. We just wanted to be very, very. notes. 
bow. Uh-huh. We're making a, a dance for the bow. Yeah, that's his frog. Okay, then... So this is E at the frog. That right at the frog. Fa, fa, fa. Yes. 
Which one should I hear? Either. I think I've memorized both. Okay. Uh, well, let's maybe do Sicilian. We'll okay. stay in the Chrysler mode today. Okay. And let's see what, uh, where it is. Okay. Um, this one we have worked together on once for mm -hmm. this. Before we left. Yeah. Yeah. Okay.
gonna just stay here. Yeah, uh, this is a one here. So we just go back to the oh. third position here. Down to first position. Yes. Yeah.